Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Olivia. And for today's makeup look, I went ahead and did a winged eye look. And like I say in this video, it's been a little while since I've done a winged eye look, but I am so happy with how they turned out. And I can't wait to do more looks um, using a wing. And I just feel like a wing kind of puts it all together and makes it so much more. And um, yeah. Okay, first step I'm gonna go in with today is my glassy primer. This is the Pretty Filter Glassy Skin Balm. This is what I'm going in with. And I got this in my Boxy Charm in um, the month of February. And I used it in my last video, but I have just been loving this um, primer recently. Like it's just, it just works and it's making my makeup stay on and feel great. And it literally lasts all day too. The consistency is thicker but it goes on so smooth and it feels so hydrating too so i am loving this guy next i'm going to go in with my it cosmetics my cc cream and this is in shade fair i'm going to go in with my damp beauty blender is my concealer and I'm gonna go in with my Morphe concealer in my Tarte Tape Shape Concealer. This one is a little bit darker and more full coverage. And then this other one is just a little bit of a lighter color. Just wanna mix the two. And to blend this in, I'm gonna go in with my Morphe M173 brush. I'm just going to set the face and I'm going to go in with my Skin London brush. Start with the under eyes. Now 
Okay, before we go on to the rest of the face, um, I'm gonna go in with my eyes. So I'm gonna do my eyebrows. I'm gonna go in with the Anastasia Brow Wiz and then the clear brow, <laughs> the clear brow gel. So I'm gonna do that off camera because eyebrows are so boring to watch and I will be right back. Brows are done. Now I'm gonna go in with my Jaclyn Cosmetics uh, Luminous Powder in the shade Do Me. And I'm just going to put this all over my face just to give me um, a glow on the overall face. Um, not just a highlight, but it's just going to make me really glowy. So I'm going to go in with that. I'm going to use my Morphe E41 brush. Before I go in with my bronzer or my blush or highlight, anything else on the face, that I'm going to go in with my eyes because I'm going to do a winged eyeliner look, just like it says in the title of the video. I'm going to go in and do a winged look, um, keep the eyeshadow down to a minimum today because I really want the focus to look on the winged eye and the lashes. Onto the eyes, I'm going to go in with my Jaclyn Hill Palette Volume 2. This is the Volume 2 palette and I love it. Uh, I love her first palette so much. Like I think that she's going to be my number all. I can't talk. That's going to be my number one like go-to palette for any look. Like You can literally create any look with that palette. But I'm so excited to use this palette because look at all. The beautiful shades like they're just so fun and vibrant and bright and shiny and like perfect for summer perfect for spring I'm just so excited that she came out with something totally different than her first palette first I'm gonna go in with the shade certified which is right here and I'm going to use my skin London brush And I'm just going to put this all over the eyelid. This is just going to help for like an overall base coat, not just going straight on to your um, eyelid because sometimes colors don't pick up so well. So I'm just going to go in with like a neutral light shade and then we'll go in with the other. Next, I'm going to go in with the shade Perfectionist, which is right here. And I'm going to put this on the outer corner of my eye. And just on the eyelid, not up top of it. Going in with that same brush, I want to make it a little bit darker, so I'm going to go in with the shade Comfort Zone, which is right here. And I'm going to put that on the outer corner, like right here. Like when I say outer corner, I mean way outer corner. <laughs> I'm really loving these brushes that I got from the Skin um, London line. They have an Instagram page and um, right on their Instagram page, you can go to their website, or you can just go to their website too, but um, they have so many brushes, and I am just so glad that I got that I got this, because this brush right here, it has an angle to it, so it literally goes perfect right on your eyelid, like, it's just 
fits right there. It's so perfect. So I'm so glad that I got these brushes. This is my favorite brush right here. My favorite. Okay, now I'm gonna go into um, the inner corner, like where it's all kind of bright. I'm gonna brighten that up just a little bit more. And I'm gonna go with the shade I'm in it. And I'm gonna go in with the shade, with, not the shade, the brush. I'm gonna go in with the brush Morphe E36. This is just a very um, tight and precise brush that works well in the inner corner. So this shade is not a white. It has a, what is it like, um, Earl Desson? I don't know the word, but it has a shade to it that is like a purple hue. I don't know if you can tell, but it's so beautiful. I can't wait to use this shade when I do um, a purple look, like with all these colors. I can't wait to do a look with that because this white that has the purple in it will look so pretty. So the next shade I'm going to go in with, it's going to be in the center of my eyelid to connect the two shades together and it's going to be the shade Drama Queen. I'm going to go in with my Morphe E18 brush. Waterproof liquid eyeliner. This is it. And the shade black. <sighs> the worst part about doing your eyeliner is seriously getting one eye perfect and then you go to do the other eye and it's like, it's not gonna work. So, so please pray for me that I get this correct. Okay, I'm gonna look in my mirror because this is so hard. Next, let's go in with the mascara because that's a game changer right there. So I'm just gonna curl my lashes. I'm gonna go in with my Bad Gal Bang by Benefit. This is literally the only mascara that I will use because everything else clumps up on me. So I've had this for a long time because it literally lasts forever and it's still going strong. It literally just gets every lash and adds so much length and volume, like so pretty. So here's my right eye compared to my left eye. Such a difference. 
so pretty. going to use my MAC Giga Black Lash. It has very tiny little bristles and it just gets every lash. And with the lower uh, wispy lashes today, they're so beautiful. So I'm going to pop these bad boys on. Okay, lashes are done. They are on and I love these wispies so much. I get them at Ulta too if you guys are wondering comes in a three pack and they're like 10 or 11 dollars I think so first I'm gonna go in with my Hula bronzer this is what I wear every day for bronzer and I go in with my Morphe 108 brush And this is Love at First Sight. And I'm going to use my Skin London brush to apply it. Now I'm going to go in with my Sephora. This is actually a um, eyeshadow, but I use it as a highlighter because I think it looks so beautiful on my skin and gives you such a beautiful glow. And this is um, the shade Satin Corset. And I'm going to use uh, my fan brush by The Skin London. do want to go in um, with the Jaclyn palette. I want to go on to the outer corner and I want to go in with the shade uh, Comfort Zone. Go in with Morphe E36 brush. And set my face using the Morphe Continuous Setting Mist. Set my face first, and then I'll go in with a lipstick. Today I'm going to go in with uh, Too Faced Melted Matte. This is what it looks like. Shade Queen B. Okay guys, so that is the look for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did. I love making every video that I do. Um, you guys know that I just love fashion and makeup and beauty and um, I just love it all and sharing it with you guys and giving you guys tips and tricks and hearing back from you guys too. Um, yeah, I just really love it so much. And 
comment down below subscribe you know do all the four things for me like comment subscribe touch that notification bell to get that next reminder of when my next video is up so thanks guys bye